My name is Ben Hudson and I'm the Chief Executive of BAE Systems Australia. I'm Natalie Waldy and I'm the Program Manager for Autonomy with BAE Systems. I'm Mick Rump, I'm the Principal Technologist for Autonomy for BAE Systems Australia and I'm also the Solution Architect for the Strix aircraft platform. Strix is, uh, is entirely new, it's a new concept. We've virtualised a, a, a tilt rotor aircraft and we uniquely combine the capabilities of vertical takeoff and landing before tra transitioning to conventional flight. The Strix platform is different because it's a unique combination of range, payload and a vertical takeoff capability. So that means the aircraft doesn't need a runway or all the supporting infrastructure to take off and land. Strix has been created because we saw a gap in the market and what we're trying to do is, uh, is with Strix uh, meet the needs of the future battlefield and we're combining the unique capabilities of vertical takeoff and landing aircraft with that of, a, of conventional flight and what that gives us is uh, a unique uh, range and speed uh, mix with the low uh, logistics impact of a vertical takeoff and landing aircraft. The platform ideally will be operated as a predominantly autonomous system most of the time. Takeoff and landing and the transition um, from vertical to horizontal flight will be fully autonomous. Autonomous technologies aren't intended to replace the human in the modern battlefield, but rather to augment them. To me, it's uh, the ability to apply effects without having to have a human in harm's way. And Strix is a platform that allows that to be done extremely flexibly whether it's land or maritime or other domains, you've got a platform that you can deploy in a variety of scenarios and keep our people safe.